Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on in, welcome on in. We are back for some more Haikyuu. Last time we watched episode one, the pilot of this series, and my god, the support was crazy. Y'all love it, love it, love it, and I love seeing it. That <laughs> I love seeing that you guys love it. Um, a ton of uh, subscribers that I already had came through, and they're loving the series already. A lot of new subscribers came through, and just for this series, basically. So, for any of you guys that are new, welcome in. Thank you guys so much for coming through on the channel to support this series. Now, it is time to get back into more Haikyuu, and I'm going to be honest with you. Um, first episode didn't grasp me as much as I might have wanted it to, but I mean, that never happens really with most series for me. Um, first episode isn't really the one that grabs me, so uh, hopefully this uh, series, I could see it interests me, but it hasn't really hooked me just yet. Um, I mean, something like Hunter x Hunter, it took me like, I don't know, 10, 11 episodes for it to really like hook me. I mean, One Piece was a minute, but um, eventually it did get me. Uh, the moment I saw Zoro, you know, I had to keep watching. But now it's back. We're on Haikyuu mode. So enough talk about other anime. Let us get to episode two of Haikyuu Rs. Let's go. All right. Oh my God, that's loud. Hold up. All right, there we go. All right, let's see what's going on here. My first and last official match of junior high. My team was creamed. Oh. <laughs> Y'all gonna be on the same team. That's kind of hilarious though. You're a rival on the same team. Y'all gotta work together. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think I could watch the opening next episode. So uh, I'm gonna skip it for now here. So let's go ahead and uh, skip ahead a bit. All right, let's go back. All right, there we go. Maybe it's someone else. Uh, are you sure that? Are you sure that's the rationalization you want to come through? Like, <laughs> that is not. <laughs> You're not seeing Jake. Kageyama Tobio. Okay. You're that guy from last year. Whatever your name. <laughs> he not to show you. Okay. So his name is Shoyo. Uh, his last name is Hinata. All right. I don't even know if he's a rubber person around. Mm, yeah, he remembers his potential. He's like a diamond in the rough, bro. He just needs to be polished, bro. Oh, he doesn't take advantage of these abilities at all. Yeah, okay. Maybe he might want to train him. You know, you got claw. You got more than clobbered, bro. Y'all got fucking decimated. Jesus. <laughs> so that shit was last year. Okay. That's what I came here prepared to do. So why are you here? How can I kick your ass if we're on the... <laughs> there are way more successful schools to choose from. Uh, <laughs> he didn't make it in. So this was his safety. <laughs> You're the king of the court. That's not what he wants to be called, bro. Who this? Who this? But ew, what is wrong? Fix your face, bro. <laughs> what do you guys think? Yeah, pull his ass back, Kagama. Blast him with your upperclassman prestige. What the hell are you, Tanika? What the fuck is wrong with you, bro? <laughs> Kagama is slightly taller than them. These high schoolers are still kind of huge. So like, so is so right now is Hinata a freshman? He's a freshman in high school, and these guys are upperclassmen, like junior seniors, that type of shit. I don't know um how like I don't know. If uh, Japan's, you know, whole grading or um, what's it called? Um, the way that students are organized and all that. I don't know if it's the same as America. I don't know if they go uh, freshman, sophomore, junior, junior, senior, or if they have a different way of organizing it. But I'm assuming uh, Hinata here is first year, and then these guys are like upper class for maybe third, fourth, or fourth years. <laughs> I completely ignored him. 180 centimeters. You're a cocky one. How? You just told you his height. What does that mean? You mean the other applicant named Hinata is you? Oh, okay. But they're expecting him to be taller? Like, <laughs> so both of you chose Karasuna. I wouldn't say uh, this man, King of the Court, exactly chose uh, Karasuna, but we'll see. You're small and you were all over the place, but you had fight. Oh, okay, they noticed too. Okay, that's cool. Hey, yeah, he's got hops, that's for sure. You really haven't grown much at all. <laughs> Maybe small, but he got hops. That's what's up. I'll become the ace of Karasuna. Oh, shit, okay. You only just got here and you're already claiming ace position. You got some. Ooh, bro. What's wrong with having aspirations? Exactly. He needs that drive. He needs some motivation. Now that you announced that you're going to be the ace, you better have improved. Oh. <laughs> He's saying you wasted three years back in middle school. You better not waste another three. Why do you say things like, yeah, exactly? Why are you, why are you roasting this kid? But don't want to make it sound like everything I've done is for nothing. Oh, don't make it sound. Okay, okay, okay. Don't make it sound like everything I've done for support. Nothing, bro. You did everything for something. You do realize that you're not enemies anymore. Yeah, exactly. All on the same team now. How do you win or lose that? Exactly. Yeah, you can't exactly do a 1v1 in a volleyball. You're getting noisy volleyball team <laughs> with your face. <laughs> I've been practicing with all kinds of people. Yeah, he's been playing with everyone. <laughs> Listen to this music, bro. Okay, it's pretty groovy. All right, I like it. Oh, what is that? Anim what the fuck was that? 
Dude, Mitt Mads went all out. Y'all see that animation? That shit went... <laughs> the fuck was that? God, no girls or old ladies teams serve like that. <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, y'all about to get fucking expelled, my boy. Slapped his toupee right off. They knocked that toupee right off. Sawamura, holy shit. Shit, I thought his mole was about to pop off. They took his whole toupee off. No apologies necessary. Holy shit. But I want you to pretend you saw nothing. <laughs> yeah, you did not see that shit. <laughs> Holy fuck. Look at the crow. Look at the crow. Look at the crows. Wait, what did he say about crows? He said something about crows. He said something about crows. The clipped crows. And sometimes walk right past students in nearby cars in high school. Gave me goosebumps. Mm, he has yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Yeah, that same kind of, kind of like that same uh, experience there. We're going. Oh shit! Going there one more time. <laughs> you show me a crow. I, I'm all for it, bro. I'm all for it. We're going to the same court as the little giant. Ah, okay. There are plenty of high schools that treat the uh, treat the nationals like a tentative team. Oh shit! <laughs> Y'all don't have to like it. Look at his face. And Junior High may have been separated by a net. Oh my god, he looks like a fucking psychopath This shit. I don't care how good you are or how hard you intend to play. Anyone who causes trouble for the team with petty rivalry. That face he made. He said, who the fuck do you think you're messing with, bro? Y'all better play nice. <laughs> Y'all better fucking play nice. He said, I don't care how hard you trade. I don't care how good you think you are. Y'all better play nice. Both of them are ball hogs. What are Please let me play volleyball. <laughs> I'll get along with Kageyama. Now he's begging. What have you done? God, look at <laughs> the most goddamn blankest stare ever. What is that? Now you're on. Yeah, <laughs> what the hell's with you? <laughs> God, why are you actually being honest with me? That, that face you gave it sound, it sound like you're gonna kill him if you didn't. Volleyball's like <laughs> the alt any any sport. Ultimate teamwork is required if you guys want to excel. You guys can't be. The fuck was that? <laughs> slapped the shit out of him. <laughs> oh, I thought the ball slapped him and he fell. I didn't know he dove for it. <laughs> I thought it slapped the shit out of him and he fell down. There's a court and a ball within reach. I hate being in a doghouse. Did you find your team awareness? It's not something you find. It's something you. It's something you train with. Yep. Oh, he's about to call him king of the court again. We'll challenge them to a two-on-two -two match. If we win, we get to join. If we work together, we'll look like teammates, like it or not. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no one would agree to that after we talked out. <laughs> yeah, don't drag me down. You better keep up. <laughs> Only match I ever played in junior high was against was the one against your team. Mm. We never had enough players to play to apply to tournaments until then. And I had no place to play, so I always practiced in the corner of the gym or the hallway. Uh, yeah. Yep. Means I could play volleyball. I could endure anything for a little while. <laughs> That's what he calls it. <laughs> I'll do my best to not look at you that way. I can't see what's up. <laughs> I took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Y'all about to be fucking distracted. Kyoko. Okay. Thanks for all your hard work. I'll carry that. She's gonna slap the shit out of you with that, bro. She looks like the type. <laughs> she looks like the type. Wow. Okay. He's that type of dude, bro. What was that face? What are they planning to do? What the fuck? All right, I guess that is that is that gonna be Hinata's uh, love interest here? Oh, they already predicted. <laughs> I'll just cool their heads and demonstrate how they learn the error in their ways. We'll prove that we could play. <laughs> they had to count it down. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I kind of like guys like them. Hey man, they got the drive. Yeah, you never. We'll accept the penalty of your choice. Two other first years are going to be joining us. We'll have you play them three on three. It's a match we hold every year for our new members to see what they're like. Oh. So who's gonna be joining them? Yeah, <laughs> he said me. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah, that, you did say that, bro. Oh, he's <laughs> some fucking reverse psychology over here. He's that. Yeah, he's exactly. He's exactly the type of guy that I thought he was. <laughs> I thought you were the one that'd be able to handle these ki kids like this. But you know what? If you can't, <laughs> oh. a team can't win with a grandstanding, over aggressive, egocentric. Oh shit! The roasts are real. <laughs> That's when his animation gets wild. That's how you know it's his thing. <laughs> Here because he's actually going to that. Oh shit. Yeah, <laughs> they're just focusing on this kid. <laughs> this is enough. You're up a Oh shit. Is there a special reason for that? 
Because he wants the best team possible. Is there any other reason? <laughs> Oh, I mean, he's looking at the bright side of things. <laughs> we know who the optimist is in this. <laughs> you get to slam. Oh, shit. That's not teamwork. The setter is the team's play marker. The setter is the one who has the most contact with the ball. What the fuck? The setter's job is way too difficult and doesn't stand out. You can't tell it from the angle you see on TV. But if you watch from the end of the court, you'll be able to see how fast the setter sets the ball. It flies from one side of the court to the other, and the ball passes right in front of the opponent's blockers. But there's a spiker ready to strike the ball, and he smashes that sucker in. I'm learning some volleyball techniques over here. <laughs> spiker really is cool, but it's the setter. Who tricks the opponent to blocking and breaks the wall open for the spiker to get through. Setter's job is difficult, cool, and awesome. Yeah, he, he said that. He said that four minutes ago. <laughs> That's why it's teamwork. You gotta be able to, you know, switch up positions with each other at the moment's notice. This guy. <laughs> Just need to set for the second year guy. Oh, okay, he's second year. Okay. Hey, we have to work on your shitty receiving my Saturday. <laughs> yeah, you need to stop getting hit in the face every time you try to receive the ball. I guess we really gotta start morning practice at 7 a.m. <laughs> he's, uh, he's telling them on purpose. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I like that. 5 a.m. Okay, so they want to be two hours earlier, so they got some uh, alone time to practice here. All right, cool. I like this rivalry. I like it. Nice to see we got we got a we got a nice rivalry going on here. Something for them to shoot for. <laughs> it was because he forgot his bag. <laughs> oh, five. Okay, so they came. Okay, so it's back in the morning. What a great yeah. <laughs> he's trying to be that guy, you know. <laughs> <laughs> the guy that like all the uh, underclassmen look up to and shit. <laughs> yeah, they were playing hard. They were playing like pros. Supposedly had exception exception ability for a junior high student. Okay, so they're both in the same grade around there. He was almost nothing to show for it. He could drag down the team. What sets the situation apart from him? He is kind of like a raw mass of agility. Yeah, yeah, he's not refined. That's what he needs training. He is not, he's not nearly at his full potential. His extraordinary speed and reflexes plus that jumping ability. But he didn't have a setter in junior high. True, true. Kageyama, on the other hand, wants a spiker fast enough for it. Oh, shit, yo, they could be like the perfect combo. The perfect setter and the perfect striker. That, that's about to be lit, bro. That's about to be fucking lit. Get them to work in combination. Oh shit, all the crows coming through, bro. This is I love this shit. Let's go, don't you agree? Bro, when they learn how to work together, they're about to be fucking beasts. You got a long way to go before combos come into play. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> how to learn how to play first. Is this the ending? Ah, uh, okay. All right, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. Episode two of High Key You. All right, now I think this uh, this anime has grasped me a lot more. I think this uh, this was... I feel like it takes two episodes, actually, because this episode one and episode two, uh, episode one was kind of weak, but this, this really grabbed me in. Now I know what the drive is, what the goal is, what they're trying to do, and how they're trying to do it. I see the motivations, the animation coming through, like little bits and pieces, so I know it's about to be fire in the end here. Now, I like what they're trying to show here. It's, it's something different than what I normally see, and I'm not much of an anime connoisseur, but in terms of anime that I have seen, however few they may be, it's just limited like limited to like Dragon Ball, One Punch Man, and Full Metal Alchemist, you know, a bit of One Piece, um, a bit of Hunter Hunter. I mean that, that's basically all I've really seen up until this point. And this is very different for me personally, because I never really watched a sports anime. Um I know there's a whole lot more out there, but in terms of what I've already seen, it's a lot different for me. So I like what I'm seeing so far. It's it's a different take on um I mean, in terms of the whole, like, uh, anime scene that I know so far, um, I like the take on teamwork that they're showing here. Like, two people who, um, apart, you know, they, 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 have their, they have their strengths, you know, they have their strengths apart, but they don't exactly have what it takes to, sorry, that's my phone. They don't exactly have what it takes to work together yet, and if they do, they can definitely be a dynamic duo with their, you know, with their abilities that they have apart, because together with a perfect setter and a perfect striker, you know, Kageyama has the, he has the, he has the strength. No, my camera, get nervous. Kageyama has what it takes to be a strong setter and be able to set up um, Hinata here as, um, you know, he was a really good striker. He had the speed, he had the agility, he had the hops, but he didn't exactly have the team to back him up. So with Kageyama's strength in setting and his strength in striking. Um, you know, they're they're basically you know saying that 
and they're going to be a strong pair for the team. So I can't wait to see what happens once they get refined, once they got training, once they're able to work together. There's about to be some badass moments. So anyways, let us get into episode three over here. I'm going to get right into it. Episode three, bro. Episode three. Come on, let's go. Let's do it right away. I can actually watch the opening now, so I'll be watching that here as well. Your feet stopped short. What happened to your sir receiving reflex? Okay, you need to focus. All right. Yeah, you got to learn how to receive first, bro. I should give you fair warning. Daichi is usually gentle, but he's extremely scary when he gets angry. Yeah, we've seen that. We've seen that for sure. <laughs> yes, we have. Yeah, we know. <laughs> we know, bro. What are you going to find about this practice? It won't be good for me. Oh, shit. Wait, who found him? Is it the other guy? Suga. Okay, okay. This guy's name is Suga. I'm clearly acting weird yesterday. I mean, you asked to hold on to the keys despite barely making time, making it on time most of <laughs> Oh, here we go. Let's watch the opening here. Let us watch the opening. So Suga knows about their early morning trainings, but Daichi doesn't just yet. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, yo, this this, this, this this is pretty good. I like this. It's not it's not too crazy. It's not too wild so far. I love the crows, bro. The crows in this shit is dope. All right. Okay, this is cool. I like this. All right. Yo. Yeah, now it's getting hype, bro. It's getting wild over here. Look at this. Oh, fucking all all the poses, all, all like the shots and the angles and everything. This is cool as shit, bro. All right, that's that. Uh, I forgot her name already. Kyoko, is that her name? <laughs> Look at my man zooming around. That was tight. That was tight. <laughs> that was tight, bro. <laughs> He's about to be the little giant, bro. He's about to become the next little giant. What was the uh, t episode name? Hold up. A, form a, form a formidable ally. I can't speak today. <laughs> you need to receive, bro. You need. To he doesn't have patience. That's what it is. He's a little ball of energy. Once he trains and once he's actually focused, all the energy, like, you know, like, once he has that, um, energy, <laughs> I said hell no. Once he has that energy, like, you know, it's gonna be tight. Sets and attacks only come after a receive. Stop acting like you're a hot shit. <laughs> Holy shit, three out three match this Saturday. I'm doing this for Tonic as much as I can. Let him do the attacking. As for you, just try not to hold us down. Damn, that's not teamwork, bro. That's like compromising. I'll set for anyone I deem essential to winning. Wow, you think you got like a god complex, Jesus? Right now, I don't think you are. Oh shit! Look at the look at look at man's in the back over here. <laughs> What's it take to set him? And if you, okay, we're almost out of time. We better clean him up. Erase all evidence. <laughs> so leap it in the middle class, dude. Snooze, and I know how that feels, man. I know how that feels. Lower your hips more and hit like you're sending it right back in the direction it came from. Mm, okay. Oh shit, he got it pretty good. There you go. I'm Karasuno, starting setter, you know. Hey, okay. You want to practice spiking, right? Spiking is about to be his jam, bro. Spiking is going to be his jam. Feels great when you get one just right. Above all, it's so cool. <laughs> Sounds like you've got quite the spike. Oh shit, let's go. When I was junior high, I didn't even have teammates until third year, let alone a setter. Oh, okay, cool. My friend on the basketball team would set for me. <laughs> even after I even after I retired, first year's volleyball moms and setters from the girls team set for me. Oh, okay, so that's who he was playing with that time. All right. While they were good friends of mine, so I was really looking forward to meeting the setter. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you met the setter. I had high hopes. <laughs> Until I got here, like I said, I was setting to you. Don't worry. <laughs> All right, that's cool. This man, this man, okay, he's got it. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Why do you keep getting in Kageyama's face? Okay, okay. Firstly, I try to avoid getting on the bad side of good players as much as possible. He was great at everything he did. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. He was taller than me to boot. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. He's just so formidable. Really hated when he stood in front of me. Mm, yeah, he wanted. He came here so he could beat him, but. Yep. Yeah, okay. So that's why he doesn't want only him to set for him. He wants to be... That's why he feel like he was losing. All right. He's practicing on his lunch break. I just want to be good enough to defeat Kageyama. Yeah, he's like, you think he's better than you. Yeah. <laughs> it was hard for him to say that. <laughs> make your greatest opponent your greatest ally. I don't think you're essential to winning. You got to make him respect you. All right, let's get back to receiving. You about to go in and stretch with them? <laughs> get them stretching exercises in? Oh yeah, he's copying their stretches. Okay, <laughs> right outside, like 
<laughs> bro. There's not enough room to play ball here. Mm, okay, so he's yeah, he's, okay. he's offering to practice with him. All right. They're trying to <laughs> they're trying to hit the water bottle. <laughs> Let's see, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yeah, I wonder why. I, what have y'all been doing? <laughs> Sorry if the camera was moving right there. My dog was like pushing around the tripod. All right, let's get back to it. I'm going to win this Saturday. Be allowed into the gym. Okay, and join this team for real. Yeah, let's get started for real, for real. I guess I'll, I'll, we also need to win so you can play Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> get it, get it. Oh, shit. Yeah, he called you king. <laughs> yeah, he said crap. <laughs> Yeah, don't call him fucking king, bro. He ain't the king yet. You can get, you can get like little zoom, little zoom. Wind of the fast wind. What the hell is that? Yeah, wind twice. <laughs> the forest. No, 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 no. Jet black. What the? <laughs> Dude, you don't come up with your nickname. It just comes. It just comes through. <laughs> what the hell are you doing over there? <laughs> Took the words right out of my mouth. Don't you cluck your tongue at me? Wow. Stop beaming it at this fool. Holy shit. You're not supposed to receive with your face. I mean, you're beaming it at his face. So what else do you expect him to do? I don't know why, but I just don't like those first year new. <laughs> you say that every time you meet someone new. Yeah, you like the ones you're training with right now. You just got to give them a chance. That's how you're wired. I guess this guy, he's like, yeah, you got Kageyama. So you good. <laughs> he kind of has mellowed out since junior high. Fucking tense as hell, bro. He is intense. Either way, he's cocky as hell. He is. That's an understatement. He just wants to keep playing. Y'all been going all day. Holy shit. You're practicing outside. Yeah, w why are you being an asshole? Who are you? Are you the first years that stirred up trouble on the first day? Are you the other first years joining the team? They're first years? How? What the hell do you mean, Soon? Yeah, why are you bragging for him? <laughs> okay, Suki. He's already an asshole. He's a cocky asshole. You're Kageyama from Kirigawa first. Oh, damn. He's saying you should have been somewhere better. <laughs> he won't lose on Saturday. We... Oh, shit. Wait, do they know about the match? It might be an important match for you two. Might be. I really don't care about winning or losing. So if you two really need to win, I can go easy on you if you like. Wow. <laughs> Whether you go easy or give it or you're all. The bottom line is I'll win. Damn. Yeah, he said I'll win. <laughs> Confidence is real. Oh, you already know he's not going to be the type of guy to stop calling you. It's just because the rumor is he loses when you get called king of the court. Yeah, exactly. They're really, they're really, really pushing his buttons, bro. Watch the finals of the prefectural court qualifiers. Right that was some enter. Okay, shit. Bro, wait, 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 wait. You talk too fast. <laughs> Jesus. I watched the finals of the prefectural qualifier tournament. I guess what happened was because they couldn't tolerate it anymore either. Oh, shit, dude. Stop, y'all on the same team. Hey, hey, Kageyama, chill, chill, bro. Y'all on the same team. I don't know what they're talking about. But why is he holding back on this creepy guy? Yeah, I mean, telling lot suddenly you say something back at him. Did this team leave him because he had such a high ego and he wanted to, or, yeah. Oh, my boy jumped right over his ass. Holy shit. Shut up with the king crap. I'm here too. Hey, yeah, he's got a problem. You want to fight, bastard? <laughs> Let's take it easy and have some fun. Oh, now you want to be Mr. Nice Guy. Shut up. It's only a practice match after all. What are you guys? Class 1 4, Tsushika K. Tsushikima K. I'm young. Bro, these names. <laughs> these names wild. Hold up. I need to pause for these names. Okay. Tsu Tsukishima K. I'm just going to call you K. All right. Just going to call you K. All right. I'm Yamaguchi. Why does it go away so fast? You, you, I can't read this shit that fast. Okay, Yagamuchi, Yam, Yamaguchi, Tadashi. Okay, Tadashi, all right. Tadashi and K. Oh, but I suppose we're opponents for now. I'm looking forward to seeing your king sets. Those guys really give me... They don't give me the creeps. They just piss me the hell off. Gotta beat the crap out of them. I hope we get to see this match in this episode. We're not done yet. Yeah, he said, we still practicing. Where do you think you're going? <laughs> Let's go. Guys that get too worked up really get on my nerves. What the hell? Like the king. Okay. <laughs> They're coming in. They're like, what the fuck? Aw, oh, damn. Take too long to get in the potato. How much longer are they going to do this for? <laughs> I'm so sleepy. Yeah. <laughs> He's tired of these kids. I was wanting to play. Ooh, that was a good one. Oh, shit. Damn, he's getting worked up. Come on, Kageyama. It's too dark to see clearly. Don't hit so hard. I know, bro. <laughs> he's too... T he's intense as hell. His nerves have been on edge ever since he met that big guy. 
I'll do my best receiving until he does. All right. Let's go again, bro. Let's go again. I never had one of those bikes with the headlights. I've always wanted one, but you know, I, I, I could never find one. <laughs> I never knew where to get those from. Those, are, those are look so cool, bro. I always have to ride my bike in the darkness of night. Damn, man's is falling asleep from all the training he's doing all day. And you know, I never really play volleyball like this. I mean, I play around sometimes with some friends, but I never played seriously. So I don't really know how hard it is to learn receiving like that. So is this the way back home for him? Or is he just like biking and training? There's no way that's the way back home for him. Okay. Ooh, okay, he's getting it good. Don't go easy. He said that was easy. Get it, there you go. My boy is not getting it, bro. Get them receive, bro, bro. Oh yeah, my boy Daichi watching. Was that Daichi or Suga? Yeah, he getting them. See, look at this. He moving. Yeah, that's Suga. Okay. How long have they been at it? It's been 15 minutes since I got here. Oh shit. Holy shit, they've been going. They haven't dropped the ball for 15 minutes. His outstanding agility makes up for his lack of skill. That's true. Yeah, he's really quick. Oh, look at his arms, bro. Not yet. I haven't let the ball hit the floor. Look at my boy. Hinata! Crap. Why did you do it like Yo, he's quick! He's quick! You know that amazing agility since he was in junior high. Go get it, boy. Go get it, boy. I feel like he has the tenacity to become a winner. Yeah, he doesn't give up. My man is the Luffy of volleyball. <laughs> he's not about to be right to see. His forte lies somewhere else. Holy shit, he's coming through. How's my man going all out just for training? All set for anyone I deem essential to winning. He, you damn well better believe he's essential to winning. But right now, I don't think you are. Yeah, you just proved your ass wrong. Bro, it's only been three episodes. I'm already seeing like a little bit of growth in him. Character growth, of course, but like just like physically, just a tiny bit. I can see it. He's set for him. There you go. And now that's too worn out to spike the. Oh, yeah, he gave him a set. Okay, okay. So, yeah, that's what that was. All right. Yeah, there you go. Get to spike it, my boy. Man's really got it still. Holy shit. That was tight. That was fucking tight, bro. Okay. Damn straight he can jump. Holy shit. How does someone love volleyball this much? I think that meant something special to you. Yeah, okay. They're getting a little bit closer. They're getting a little bit closer in terms of teamwork. We take for granted that a setter will set for us, but for him, let's win tomorrow. Let's go! Teamwork makes the dream work, my boy. But hey, oh, let's go. Let's go, bro. <laughs> now he can be my most formidable ally. He's a throw up. Yeah, you've been overworking yourself. Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. My man said, <laughs> I've been trading way too hard. Do we get to see game day in this episode too? Please tell me we do. Please tell me. Wait, how long we got? I think we did. Oh. Yeah, we barely got no. I don't think we're gonna see the games. He is. Sp I might have to do the next episode, bro. This shit is lit. <laughs> he said, "Wait up, you idiot! What the fuck? What's the point in getting worn out before the match?" I know, right? Well, that was that was a warm up. That was a warm up, okay? <laughs> that was a warm up, dude. It is almost 11. For me. I haven't even eaten breakfast, but I need I need to keep going. <laughs> I need to keep going. He's irritating and pisses me off. That's an understatement. Boom! How do I make training look so dope? But he's going to set for me from now on. Mm-hmm. A setter is going to set for me. Legit set. Let's fucking go. Y'all are going to go off. I don't think they're going to show the match. I ha Dude, I want to see this match, though. Is this going to be a three-episode video? I might have to, have to. I might have to make this three episodes, bro. I need to see this match right now. I can't wait till next time I watch this. Yeah, fuck that. No, 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 no. I'm going to the next episode, bro. Can I watch the ending, though? I want to watch the ending, kind of. Let's, let's, get, let's get into the ending. This is getting so lit, bro. Why is volleyball is so hype? <laughs> Why the fuck is volleyball so hype, bro? Man, Hinata, he's <laughs> he killing it. He killing it for sure. He is killing it for sure. Am I still recording? Okay, yeah, I am still. All right, cool. Standing on an empty field. I breathe into the night air. Hey, hey, hey. They even got some great animation for the ending too. No, no, no one really stays for the ending and they still went off animating for it. Okay, I like this, okay. This is dope, this is dope. This anime is dope, this anime is dope. I like it. Still know what the hell is up with this chick though. Don't know who those two are. All right, so I'm assuming these are all other members of the volleyball team that we have yet to meet. So, so far we've only met um, the three upper, uh, three, um, We've met Daichi, uh, Suga, and what was the other guy's name? Tanada? Uh, we know Hinata, we know Kageyama. We met uh, this, uh, what's the other guy's name? Ki or something like that, Suki. And uh, Tageyama? No, no, not Tageyama. Uh, 
Tagashi. Tagashi? Was that his name? Tagashi? I think so. All right. Um, I'm going to do one more. I have to. I have to. Episode four, bro. I have to see this next. Okay. No volleyball player is a soloist. They're all parts of a larger orchestra. It's all over the... It's all over the moment even one of them starts to believe he's special. Bernardo Rezende, coach of the Brazil men's national volleyball team, the top-ranked team in the world, from the book The People and System That Made Brazilian Volleyball the Greatest by Yonamushi Noriko. Okay. Okay, I'm not going to read the book, but <laughs> it's a nice quote. <laughs> all right, I need to see this match, bro. I need to see this match, bro. You thought you could be a solo act, bro, but that ain't how volleyball works. Yeah, that's what we were, yeah, I remember seeing that in the first episode. You just kept yelling at everybody. It was just like, yeah, you had no one there now. You kept yelling at everyone left. They said, your ego is too damn big. It's just filling up the whole court. <laughs> His ego is filling up the whole ass court. There's no room for them in there. <laughs> yeah, you egocentric king. That's why he doesn't like being called the king, because that's the reason why everyone left his ass. He said, fuck your kingly, fuck, fuck your king leadership here. Look at this man. <laughs> Is that hottie? <laughs> I think she might be the team. Oh, she's a team manager. Oh, okay. All right, let's get started. Daichi, I'll be on Tsukishima's team. Oh, shit. The captain's going to be on the other side. Tanaka's a better attacker than me. Mm, okay, Tanaka. Is that what I said before? Did I say Tanada? It's Tanaka. Okay. Oh, his ear, bro. <laughs> I like to see the king on his knees in defeat, too. He's doing this on purpose, obviously. He's trying to... He's trying to yeah, exactly. He just wants... What is his, like... Lonesome King who lost all of his lackeys in particular is a sight for sore eyes. Oh, shit. Yeah, he's just trying to, like, piss them off, okay? Can you believe what he just said? What the fuck is that aura? What the fuck? <laughs> he's dead, yeah. He's trying to get on their bad side, bro. That's what he's trying to do right now. I gotta listen to this opening one more time. I gotta listen to this opening one more time, bro. The heat flickers. Sweat glitters on my skin. Shouts echo and shoulders hit. Come on, come on. Hey, I like this. It's about to get hype. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, I love this part. This part is fucking hype, bro. Let's go. I love it when they when they like hate each other and shit. When they eventually work, learn to work together as a team. Like the way Hinata and Kageyama are sort of coming towards too. But if they have that for like the rest of the team, that's going to be tight. I like that. Because so far, uh, the Tsuki guy, this tall ass bitch, he's even like an asshole. But uh, if they can get past, I feel like he's doing it on purpose though. Maybe he's like, I think he feel, because what he said before, is he trying to piss them off on purpose so that they don't let other people get to the, like, get, like, all up in their heads like that? Because I feel like there's going to be a lot of shit talking in this, so <laughs> they better learn how to, like, um, get over the shit talking like that. So, I guess, it, I guess it's a smart way to do it. But, uh, he's, he's going a bit too overboard, he's kind of just making him seem like an asshole. Hopefully, though, hopefully he can get over it. Oh, shit, they got it. That was a strong spike. Holy shit. He's putting a lot more power in than usual. <laughs> what is up with shaking off your shirt, bro? <laughs> Tone it down and keep your shirt on. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Set it up for him. He's got it. And I'm going to kick off my first match in high school with a bang. Yeah, he's got hops, but he's got a lot of height on him. He's got a... Damn, height is important in volleyball, that's for sure. I was surprised the other night as well as before. Okay. Now, if only you were 30 centimeters tall, you could have been a superstar. Damn. He may be huge, but he's only one guy. So what is he going to have to do? Jump higher or go faster? You know, the one's opponents can't keep up. Oh, shit. And the one's teammates can't keep up with you. Oh, shit. Why? <sighs> Oh my god. <laughs> he said opponents and teammates can't keep up with. Oh shit. Oh shit, here we go. The ultimate setter. Is he gonna set? Oh, okay, he's serving. Okay, yeah, he's serving. Kageyama's jump serve. It was pretty overwhelming. I'm gonna score a bunch of points all at once. <laughs> Ooh, oh, she, he, oh, fuck. I thought he, I thought he received it. Damn. He said he receives that da our Daichi's forte. Oh, uh, yeah, that was a good receive. What are you expecting to score a few points? <laughs> I don't have any outstanding talents, but I spent two years more than you guys etching this receiving skill into my body. Fuck. Don't think it, I'm just going down without a fight. <laughs> he said, I ain't gonna go easy on you kids. But other schools must have gotten scared of his skills and named him that. Yeah, that's what I assumed. I'm sure there are a lot of people who think that way. Oh, it's for another reason? But rumor has it that he was given the nickname King of the Court by the guys from Kirigawa Fist first, okay. Oh, yeah, okay, that's what I'm... Oppressive... 
Yeah. Holy shit. I had only heard rumors about it at first, but I was convinced after watching that match. Yeah. He got so oppressive that they had to sub him out for the final. He's really that much of just like... I didn't think he took it that seriously. I wasn't even serious, it's just he, he... I think he just has like some type of superiority complex. Either that or... I don't know what it is about him. Yeah, okay. Damn, bro, what kind of set was that? <laughs> Your sets are totally unreasonable. What's the point if we can't spike them? Well, we can't win unless we shake off their blocks. Oh, he's just trying to set... He's just trying to set quicker so that they can... Okay, alright. Fiat, the only one that can really keep up with the sets though are Hinata. Yeah, and that's why I say, bitch, fuck you. <laughs> so, yeah, sub his ass out. There's a rift between the team. I like that. It's dope imagery. <laughs> Quite literal, but yeah. <laughs> I, I'm just gonna say, we're not following you anymore. Mm. Kagiyama, sit your ass on the bench. That's why you stop making quick sets. Are you chickening out? Oh, okay, he's, he's scared that Hinata won't be able to hit his quicker sets. Have you been running him up for a while now? The idea of making a set only to find that there's nobody there. Oh, fuck, they're getting deep with it, bro. But that was back in junior high, right? They gotta do a so- they got, We're gonna beat Tsushima Sush and join this team for real. You get to play setter and your held, he, head held high. And then you'll set for me! Does anything else matter? Damn straight, nothing else matters. So, okay, okay, you're a spirit If you think your hard work trumps all else, then you're sorely mistaken. So yeah, he's just scared to set that quick because he, he's, he's afraid He's afraid Hinata won't be able to hit it like that. Hinata can't beat you head on yet. Oh shit! Yeah, he got there quick as fuck. Yeah, there's nobody there last time, but now he's there. He's there already. You can do a quick. There you go. Yeah, you gonna be quick enough, boy? Oh wait, was that out? Yeah, exactly. He made it to the ball. He made it to the ball. I'll take whatever sets I can get, and then I'll be grateful for them. I'll jump anywhere. I'll spike any ball. Homie really going at it, bro. Let's go. He's not a fucking tight, bro. He tight with it. Speedy little bastard. About to... S Ooh. My own. I just want to see this man fucking get that shit. Yeah. This man... So he has to give him quick sets. And then I'm pretty sure Kageyama was about to set for Tanaka there. But he still reacted instantly to Nada's voice and movement. Made such an accurate set. Exactly. You guys can run quick plays. Fast attacks like the one you just did. Oh, okay, those are quick plays. I've only ever spiked slow and looping sets. But you just did. Besides, didn't you once spike a messed up set from that beginner from Junior? Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. yeah he just, that was instinct, bro. That was instinct. He needs to aim better with his spikes, that's for sure. And I don't think they were expecting that. They need to really, like... I think now, beyond teamwork... Wait, what the fuck did he say? We've never practiced plays. Running a quick one is impossible. You guys just did it. <laughs> I think what they need to practice now is confidence in each other and trust to get that teamwork thing down. You're acting so timid, it's giving me creeps, weirdo. <laughs> Everyone has things they're just not cut out for, and you're clearly not cut, not fit to be a spiker. He's gonna prove your ass so wrong. Look at Tanaka. <laughs> I mean, be a be a bag junior in this match. I keep getting blocked no matter how much I jumped. True. Yeah. And uh, I know that a volleyball player needs to be tall. Doesn't matter how high you can jump, it'll never make up for a massive difference in height. Short stop trying to make it in a tall man's world over here. I ended up wanting to be like that. I want to fight using my own body. I want to keep winning and stay on the court as much as I can. Yo, not as fucking lit. I love it. I still want to stand on the court. Okay. Maybe there's some, uh, is there like a, a foil to, uh, I want to see if Kageyama is a foil to Hinata. Your feelings aren't going to make up for your lack of hype. No, I guess it's different story if you want to be, I guess it's easier to see them as rivals, but it'd be cool if he's also a foil, if they got like some type of opposite personality that connects them. If we can't break through, we'll just have to go around. Use every last bit of your agility and reflexes to spike my sets. There you go. Now they're going to have confidence in each other. Let's go. Is that how you do it quick? Yeah. <laughs> pull, pull the other one. Yep. We'll just try it anyway. You are totally depressed just a minute ago. <laughs> Let's go. Considering his speed and reflexes, he should be able to spike quick sets. Okay. Hey, bring on the sets. Bring them on anywhere. We haven't even figured out the signs yet, but whatever. <laughs> it's that fast? Oh, shit, he didn't know. Move faster. Oh, yeah, don't be like that. Don't be- Oh, no. No, 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 no. Come on. As if it was ever going to work right off the bat. <laughs> They're still practicing here. 
Damn, they, yeah, they need to practice with how quick. Oh, he touched it. He's getting faster. Hit the net, though. <laughs> what are you getting caught in the net? <laughs> bam or wham? Pick one. Should I do bam or should I do wham? Which one is it? You're repeating what you did in junior high. Ooh. You know, he's got reflexive speed and amazing vertical. Damn straight. If he can get used to quick plays, don't you think your sets are hindering his agility? Oh, is it? He not has neither volleyball skills nor experience. Uh, <laughs> he's not like your talented junior high teammates. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> a prodigy? No, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Can't you take his tech unique uh, talents and, well, do what? Sort of conform with them? Hang in there, sit. <laughs> Can't you put them to good use? Ah, okay, there you go. I'm a setter, so, too, so when I watched that match last year, I was intimidated. Ah, okay. But most of all, your vision and decision-making ability that lets you see right through your opponent. Okay. I don't have any of that. The motivation to win. And above all, incredible vision. There's no way you can't see through your own teammates. Oh, shit. Put him to good use. <laughs> he said, but how? But how? Show me how. I envy your athleticism. It pisses me off that you're letting it all go to waste. Ooh. So I'm going to put your abilities to good use. Give me your top speed and your best jumps. Oh, fuck. I'm going to match up with that and I'll send the ball your way. Just run as fast as you can to an area they're not marking. Jump as high as you can. And swing your arm as hard as you can. No need to keep an eye on my sets. No need to care about where the ball's, what the ball's doing. But I still want to try this. Oh, shit. He's really about to go off over here. Let's see. If he got the good serve, he's telling him to just go all out. Just go straight into it. Oh, yeah. He just went to <laughs> he just went into super focus mode. He went to ultra instinct mode over here. See through it. Where are the blockers? Where's the ball? Where's the spiker? What will he do next? Where will he jump? Where's the absolute peak of his jump? He has to aim right at him. It's the position, the timing, and the angle. Oh, shit. Look at my man. Oh, fuck. Holy shit, that shit got beamed. God damn. <laughs> He's so melodramatic. Holy shit. He had his eyes closed. <laughs> he had his eyes. Yeah. He had his eyes closed from the moment he jumped to the moment he hit the ball. The instincts. That means Kageyama made a pinpoint set into Hinata's palm when he wasn't even looking at the ball. And he delivered it with perfect accuracy at the exact moment Hinata swung his arm. Holy shit. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> Ball just hit my hand. Yeah. <laughs> Why'd you have your eyes closed? That's complete trust. I end up watching it. I end up with the ball in my zip, so I close them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you guys got it. But who the hell trusts another guy? Yeah. <laughs> you complete trust into him. I don't know what else to do right now. Yeah, you guys got no other choice over here, bro. You guys got no other choice. Mm. Yeah, look at what the hell was that, dude. It was amazing. <laughs> my set. So, oh, shit. Let's fucking go. This is what I wanted to see, man. Wait, I want to see what, I want to see, see what he said. I could bring his vertical and his agility to life. Okay. Yeah. With my set. Yes, bro. Yes. Tanaka can land his spikes. The markers will split up, which will make it easier for Tanaka to score, too. Okay. There's absolutely no com camaraderie between us. Bitch, <laughs> excuse me, but know that I'll keep sending the ball your way. Trust me and jump. Oh, this is gonna be so fucking tight. It's gonna be so tight, bro. E Holy shit, what the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, was that a fluke? Yeah, he just needs to keep practicing with it. I set it too far from the net this time. Hit harder than I thought. Hit him smack in the face. Also, pain to keep track of everything that's happening in the court. Okay. Ah, it's so much fun. Now it's nice having fun now they're working together. This is the second time. Yeah, he's laughing because he hit his face. I don't know if that's a good idea. It certainly is unbelievable. It's not that easy to trust someone completely. Yeah, that's true. Especially not the guy you consider your greatest rival. Okay, I guess they're going to go rather with the rival route. One more time. One more time, bro. I need to make a set that allows the spiker to show his... Okay, the best visibility. All right. Nice receive. He's going to mess up trying to set for that midget again. We just need to mark tonight. Tanaka. He is so fucking fast, bro. Nah, he's not gonna be able to block it. A wall. Listen up. If we can't break through, we just have to move around. Look how quick he is. Oh, shit, bro. So what if I'm not as tall as the others? You just gotta be quicker. I'll just drop one centimeter or one millimeter higher. It'll be one second faster. That's what's up. To the peak. 
that way for that one moment. Yeah, you're not as fast as him, bro. I'll be at the highest point in the court. That's what's up. A massive, massive wall since stands in front of me, blocking the way. I wonder what the view is like on the other side. Did he get it? It's a view, the view from the summit. Oh, that's what it means, because he's getting so high, like the peak of a mountain, the summit. Shit, bro, this is so tight. I'll never be able to... Yes, bro. Fuck yes. <laughs> They're both like, hell yes, bro, bro. This is that, that 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 was lit. That was lit. I fucking love it. I love it. This anime hooked me. I'm going to admit it. This anime hooked me, bro. Episode four, episode three hooked me. Episode four just sealed the deal. This is tight. I love this shit, bro. Everything from the teamwork to the potential that they have to learning how to work together, everything about it is so fucking real and so true. It's so dope to see with this amazing animation, like the build up and everything about it. I love Hinata's drive. I love everything that Kageyama is learning from his mistakes. I love all that. I love the teamwork. And I can see that they're going to have a lot more teamwork with everyone else in the future. Can't wait to get into that. But. Those were three episodes there for this one video. I, I could I couldn't stop with it. You guys saw me. I was trying. I was, I was gonna only make this two episodes, but three episodes for you guys there. Um, fantastic. I can't wait to get into more of this, and I hope you guys are enjoying as well here. Um, I know you guys love this anime. Now I can see why. I can definitely see how where the hype is coming from. I barely. I feel like I'm barely even getting started here. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully I will see you guys in the next episode of Haikyuu. Um, that's basically it for this video. Peace.